Uh, Rick uh, Vaughn. What league you been playing in? California Penal. Never heard of it. How'd you end up playing there? Stole a car. Yes, hello and welcome back to another exciting installment of Saturday Night Baseball. I am your pilot, co-pilot, bombardier, Polaris, <laughs> snowcat, host with the most awesome l ten eleven white body. As always, if you'd like to sponsor me and support me on Patreon, that would be great. I need money to operate the things. Anyway, let's go to the MVP box. Call him up. Barney Hudson. Okay, sure. Why the hell not? You'll know, do what the computer tells me to. Gonna play the White Sox again. Yeah, and the real baseball is happening and such. The Indians do not have all four lineups filled incorrectly. Would you like to CPU to optimize rosters? No, because weird things happen. Wait. Rosters. Why can I not, uh... The team management. Where, where is rosters? I'm not... I'm not... There we go. I must have been pushing the wrong buttons. Look, not depth chart. Batting order for the... I don't even know why it's bothering me about this, because... They don't even have a games to play. Sobkovayek. Sobkovayek. That's a cool name. Whoops, not that button, though. Lambert, Laker, Porter. Benoit! Those are good guys with cool names. Dempster! I bet his friends call him Trash. Get it? Trash Dempster. Okay, are you done yet? Ugh. Indians do not have a game today. Yeah, I know. But we do! Alright. Get to the. We still have lots of money. Good. Okay, let's get to that baseball thing. Play manage. Yeah, that's what I do. Who's on the mound today? Hirsch. How many strikeouts does he have? 346. 346. That is a friggin' lot. What is the record for modern strikeouts anyway? I'll look that up real quick. Modern... Strike out record. Devours? No. Man. Google, you don't know what I'm talking about sometimes. Ha! Ah! Record. Probably Nolan Ryan. Obviously, Nolan Ryan. Matt Kilroy? Who the hell is Matt Kilroy? Nolan Ryan, 1973, 385, uh, 383. Hmm. Oh, we might, we might sur surpass that, eclipse that. Yeah, if you look at that. Best strikeout guys from the Major League Baseball. It's all guys named Ryan and Johnson. Ha <laughs> ha, for some reason. Where's Randy Clemens? That's his name, right? No. That's not his name. His name was, uh... Wow, I'm doing a stupid thing here. Aren't I? That's okay. You guys just like to listen to me talk. Roger Clemens! Why did I say Randy Clemens? You big dork. Anyway. Now let's not have, uh... Whoops! I didn't mean to do that. Uh, Big Jeffy Clark, how many strikeouts do you have? 279. That would be... Respectable. Oh, Hernandez, eh? Okay, well, let's... Let's put some of the scrubs in, because we have not done that lately, and we have... Well, let me check here. 
heavy games played. See who I can substitute games. 150! Wait a second. How does he have... How does he have 150 games played when the last game was 149? Am I not counting right? Oh, that would be bad. Oh, what am I doing? With all the way in the... Oh yeah, that is all the guys that I have. 150, 100 games, Jack Crawford was injured for a while, Tony Williams. Vic Walker has played in almost every game. Don't want to interrupt anybody's gameless streak. Oh, but uh, Crawford is good. Rex Cannon has not played all the games, so... Oops. Push the buttons that mean things. Put Vandermeer there. Who needs to play more games? The catcher. And Schultz, eh? What, Vic Walker? He's played at a lot of rank games. Hmm. Whoops. Crawford. Oh, what am I thinking? Jack Crawford was out for a long time, so... Put... Swap up a position with... Escobar, put him in... Oh, come on! I'm pushing the buttons, make it happen! Oh, actually put him in left field. And put Vandermeer in center. Now they have... The guys who are in the right positions, even though it really doesn't kind of matter in the outfield. Oh, jeez, this is taking a long, is taking a long time, isn't it? Do, 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 do. Well, that's okay. Ace is high. We'll have him. S whoops. That's an easy. Ah, come on. That's an easy one. We'll substitute him for Duchesne. Quincy. Put him in for the catcher. How many games has Martinez played? 130. That's okay. The catchers wear out faster than everybody else for some reason. I bet it's because they're catchers. And the position is demanding. The shortstop. Vic Walker I don't want to replace. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Oh, Vernon Henry is a steel driving man. Third base? Yeah, why the hell not? Well... Uh, no, I don't want to... Uh, do I? You know what? Hmm... Let's take, uh... Whoops! Not what I wanted to do. Let's take, uh... Let's put Peter Wolf as the DH. What is Duchesne's regular position? Third base. Put Duchesne at third base. There you go. And then put Schultz back at shortstop, I think. No, maybe not. Who's playing second base? Vernon Henry. A steel driving man! Okay. Put him. What was the second position for Duchesne? None. Okay. Good for you. You're useless. Second position, none. Don't have any second positions. Okay. Deselect him, give, uh,. Schultz, time to start. Okay. Swap in order. There we go. That looks satisfactory. Okay, let's advance because we've been doing too much not advancing. 
What jersey should we wear? I just always love these bright red ones. Oh, let's do the old timey. 1919. Hmm. Is that a good year for the White Sox? Mm, maybe not. Go to Ulysses Stanton Cellular Field. The Indians are looking for a win in their seventh straight game. Hello, everybody, and welcome. Wayne Kuyper here along with Mike Kruko on a great night for EA Sports MVP Baseball. Today's starter, Orlando Fernandez. Tonight's American League game is between the Cleveland Indians and the Chicago White Sox. This guy is a so-so hitter. Oops. And we're underway with the first pitch, a strike. Four seam fast. Ten wins and nine losses so far. Four seam fastball, two seam fastball. Good ball slider change up. Okay. Oh. I missed that one. Strikes out the ball. Out. Slow, slow behind that curveball. This ready really becomes invisible against right-handed pitching. Randy Fox has a lot of strikeouts, I bet. Base is empty with one out. Oh, really? Strike. He's the kind of guy managers just love. And he's pitching, the relievers usually get the night off. A uh, slow roller to first. And he's out. Orlando Hernandez Pedroso. Oh. The groundskeepers have cut the field in a checkerboard formation. It is in mint condition. Nickname is El Duke. Oh, that's a base hit. That's a double, maybe. Oh, slide. That's a two out double. Nicely done. Good hustle, good hustle. Here's a righty that has pretty good success against right-handed pitching. A change up a high. The key to scoring a lot of runs is cashing in with runners in scoring position. Let's see if this guy. Oh, can cash come on! A swing He's just because I'm angry. Awesome. Come on. Line drive hit the other way. Oh, that's gonna be a base hit. He's gonna throw it to home. Base hit. Yeah. Oh, Orlando Hernandez has four World Series championships. Escobar How about that? Oh, Escobar, you should be a great guy to hit guys here. There's a strike. That was a good fastball. That was not a good fastball. Come on. Pickoff throw. Oh, really? No, don't pick off my guys. Hit towards first base. Ah, that's not going to have the distance. Third out, we go to the bottom of the inning. Oh, well. Well, they did manage a couple of hits, but they get nothing to show for it. Yeah, runners left on base. We suck. That's okay. And here's a look at the defense. There's a hell of a lot of games to play. Isn't there? Uribe is next. Juan Uribe is next. Okay. Let's go right after him with the fastball. And there it goes. Juan Cespedes Uribe. Uribe, ugh. Uribe, 10 -8. Roll them R's, man. It's hit out to center. Uh, I cranked that one. That would be good batting Make practice hit. To record the out. Get a nice pitch there to get the fly ball. Nice work. Next up, Willie Harris. Willie Harris. Willie or won't he? 
Terrific pitch there, partner. He put the fastball right where he wanted it for a call strike. That's perfect. Uh, throw the inside change up for your troubles. Oops! Missed the zone. Delivers out of the zone, and it's one and one. Okay. Come at you with the curveball low and inside. Ooh. Oh, that's a great hit. He's on with a one out single. I wish I had that hit. There's my cousin Andy again. Or Aaron. He inside outs the pitch to oh. the right side. That's not He's good. Up next, Paul Canerco. Probably gonna get a earful from the skipper yeah. for that one. Swing on the first pitch and pop it up, man. With one out. Two outs. I'd yell at my guys too. There's a strike. Guys, steal the bags is like a game of chess. It's about timing and outmoving your opponent. Let's see if this runner tries to go for it right here. Okay. Hmm, I don't know. I hope not. Here's the fastball. And a little oh, low. It missed. One ball and one strike. The guy does not have a real live fastball. No, he's just got the fundamental pitches that you like. Dude, two seamer on the outside edge is cranked forever. Over the shoulder. Wow. Okay. No score here. That's good. He goes with the pitch and takes it down the left side. Well, That's that was a crappy thing. He won a gold medal, Orlando Hernandez, I should say. Out of the zone. That's a ball. He's won a gold medal at the 1992 Barcelona Games. Whoa, there we go. He's got a gold medal He's for the 92 Olympics. Hit. Good for him. Representing Cuba. This That's that place. Not what you would call a batting coach. The runner at first is off. Steal that Just base, second. man. The guy walked right into his lead. He never Oh, that wasn't close. Oh, let's steal third base. I don't know. Sure. The runner is off to third. Oh, he's the way in there. Oh, partner, awesome. The a huge lead over there. The pitcher forgot all about him. Who is that, Vandermeer? Home, Come on now. Well, that's Walker. That's a base hit. That's that scores. Today's game. That's how you play small ball, baby. Right there. The manager needed to move the runner over, and he got a bonus with a base hit. There aren't too many left-handed hitters who struggle more than this guy against right-handers. That was a purpose pitch. He was trying to get the batter to chase. Take a middling lead off of the first. Oops. That slider is a bit slower than I thought it was. He played for the Cuba team for a lot of years. Hit into right field. I'm not going to chase. He's got it for the out. The not going to tag up for that play. one. Nope. Get a nice pitch there to get the fly ball. Nice work. Randy Fox, come on and do something instead of what you did last time. Grounded to third. And that's not it. That'll do it for the Indians in the second inning. Heading well, into the bottom of the second, the score is one to nothing. Thanks for trying. Game in and game out. This team is showing why they are the class of the division. Stepping in, Frank Thomas. Ah, oh, thanks, Kruko. I love you too. Fastball for a strike. The big hurt. Shivers down the pitch's back every time he digs into that batter's box. Got to be careful with him. Yeah, tell me about it. The pitch. Look at that fastball and oh man, oh man! I would have loved that hit. A bit more inches to the left and for the Randy Fox. Here's the curveball or a two-seam strikeout. Whatever. I throw the pitches that I don't even remember their names. Next at the plate, Jermaine Dye. Well, this guy's. Do you know there was actually another player named Frank Thomas? 
The count's 0-1. His strikeout tally in the season is an impressive 280. 280. Yeah, it was 279, but now it's 280. <laughs> That's cool. They update the statistics right in the game you're playing. Is that not awesome or what? Here comes a two-seam fastball. Go, go with the two-seam fastball. The next batter is Joe Brady. This righty hitter really needs to retool his approach against right-handed pitching. Way back in the 60s. Ground ball to the first baseman. That'll be, be an easy play. Covering. Out number three, side retired. After two innings, the score is one to nothing. Yeah, the tribe is winning. Jan Vandermeer. Hernandez delivers and it's 1-0. and oh. Yeah, back in the 60s, there was another player named Frank Thomas. 1-1 one and one the count. Oops. He played for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Ground ball to the shortstop. That was out of the zone. I don't know why I chased that. Uribe really made a nice throw right there. That's a job well done. Yeah, that was outside. He played for the Pirates from 1951 to 1958. Great pitch. He hit the corner. He was not a bad hitter at all. 0-2. Unlike this guy. He had a batting average of 266 and popped him up. 286 homers. 962 Popped runs batted in. Not too shabby at all. Watch fastball that fastball inside, out of the zone. He played for just about every team in the National League. Oh. That's in foul ground, but he should have room. Nice one. It's a one, two, three inning. After two and a half, the Indians lead by one run. Next up, Scott Bissetnis. This guy is a decent hitter. Hey. USS Bissetnik is up to plate. Clark delivers a fastball out of the zone. Walks are few and far between this right hand is on the mound. Oh, tell me about it. Well, you don't want to put the guys on for free. That's not nice. Uh, throw that two-seam fastball inside. There you goes. He put that pitch right where the catcher called for it. The batter was simply overmatched. Overmatched. Throw that curveball low and inside. And Brown ball he'll hit right it to side. Schultz. One out. Oh, that's a changeup. That's not good. And a not good a hit. Frank Thomas, the other Frank Thomas, played for the Pittsburgh Pirates. That's a ground ball to the third base. Oh, that's going to be a hard one. Got him. Oh, they got him. Just barely. Stepping in, Juan Uribe. Played for Pittsburgh, Cincinnati in 1959. Wow, I didn't think that foul was that exciting, but okay. <laughs> uh, the Chicago Cubs for 61. Oops. A ball. 19, 1960 to 61. The Milwaukee Braves used to be a thing. He played for them in 1961. Strike at the knees. That is pinpoint control right there. The catcher set a target on the corner, and the pitcher just hammered it for a strike. Strike him out. No, maybe not. Towards second. That retires the side. After three innings, the score is one to nothing. Low for a ball. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. Escobar watches a ball inside. Yep. 
Okay, watch this guy walk me. Ball misses away. I'm just gonna stand here and watch this happen. He walks him on four pitches. Four straight Fox balls. Always seem to come around to hurt you. He falls behind the batter and just never gets back into the at bat. See, that's why you're this patient at the plate. Dangerous in the batter's box. Take, take a half step off of first. Hey, partner, if the pitcher can keep the ball low in the zone, he might be able to induce a ground ball to start two. Oh! That sounded nice, but it wasn't nice. What do we got here? Um, just a bit ahead of that changeup. Right? Yeah, changeup. It's like I know what I'm talking about here. He belts it way Go! Way gone! And gone! That's how you do it, baby! Absolutely! Ha-ha! Oh, no doubt about that. You can see that thing was out of here the second it hit the bat. The wolf comes through again. He's a cool guy, you know. That'll put us up by three. It's hit to the left side. Oh, I didn't want to. I shouldn't have swung at that one, but I did. Made him look easy on that out at first, guy. Hit towards second base. What am I doing? Stop that. Two out. Well, it's okay. There's lots of baseball to go. The tasty curve ball from Hernandez. There's a good base hit. He reaches on the infield single. All right now. Oop. Right on the buttons there. Time to steal a base is now. There it goes. Oh, I should have swung at that one. That was a good hit. Why don't I do the hit and run? Huge lead over there. The pitcher fell asleep and forgot all about him. Maybe I'll do that on the next thing because we're up by a hell of a lot. There goes the runner. Oops. The runners save oh! stolen base. Go, 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 go! And the run comes. <laughs> home. Oh, perfect! Perfect, absolutely! Oh yes! See that's how you play Fox baseball. Picking up the scraps and rubbish that everybody leaves behind. Three pitches. And it strikes out because that's the way we do it. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah! Awesome! Oh. Going into the bottom of the fourth, Cleveland leads by four. I love it when a plan comes together. Next at the plate, Willie Harris. Batting against right-handed pitching, this left-handed hitter is fairly steady. Fairly steady. You could depend on him, like the Swiss to be neutral. Oh, Frank Thomas, the other Frank Thomas. Then he played for the New York the New York Mets. He couldn't check his swing. Kipe, I'm surprised he didn't say anything to the umpire about the call. There's no way he went around. You know, I don't think I've heard that one before. That's cool. Strike him out. Three yes. Back to the dugout with nothing to show for that AB. Rowan is next up. The Nye Mets are my favorite squadron, you know. Clark bringing the heat and the, bringing the dinner to the table. There's a fastball. Take oh, that's a ball. ball. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your picks. That's exactly what you saw right there. You play for the Mets from 62 to 64. Get to the left side. Then he was the tossed play. over to the Phillies, just like that ball. The next batter is Paul Pinerco. Throw that curveball on the outside edge. Oh, there it goes. Played for the Phillies 64 to 65, and then the Houston Astros in 1965. Milwaukee Braves in 1965. So he was a journeyman man. Oops. Take slow. Good thing that fell out of the zone. Finished his career with the Cubs. He's a three-time All-Star though. Ooh, I got lucky on that catch. 
1954, 1955, and 1958. That's gone. Oh dear. Hit that one all the way into Lake Michigan. Be floating in the water. Thomas makes his way to the play. Right next to the bodies. You ain't seen nothing. You hear me? Frank the Thomas is gonna crush that ball. Oh. You could have thrown it to first of all the guys that could not beat out that first base. You could have, ugh, whatever. Next up, Jermaine Dye. And Frank Thomas takes a little lead. Because it's not like he's going to steal a base. Okay now, they're swinging aggressively trying to cash in this run. So let's throw some junk out of the zone. Let's throw a two-seam fastball inside. Sure. Yeah, chase it. Exactly. It's like I know what I'm doing here or something. I'll probably throw this pitch at a hook for a home run. In the hole. Well, maybe Can not. But that's good enough. Five innings left to play. The Indians lead by three. Three runs is a good lead. He has nothing on the ball. Today. No balls. That's Oops. strike one. See, no balls. Orlando Hernandez. Oh, that's in there. He's played for a lot of the Cuban teams. A three pitch strikeout. I didn't want to swing at that one, but I did. Why do I say that? Oh well. He's got all kinds of gold medals for the Cuban team. Weak hack at a pitch out of the ah. Okay. Stop screwing around. You not paying Here attention, L10. Grounded to third. Two out. Well, that's a bit better. Yeah, get a bit sloppy now that I've won the division. The pitch is hit to right field. Whatever. The side is retired in order. You know, them After kind of meaningless out, games. Lead by three. Up next, Joe Creedy. Joe Creedy. I don't know. Is he a steel driving man too? Scout report on this guy is throwing anywhere but up and in. Up and in, up and in. Y'all gonna make me lose my mind. Here comes a tooth. Oh crap. He lifts one to right. He uh. puts it away. Never in doubt. Got lucky there. Scott Here comes the USS Putsetnik. Fouled out of play. I think it would be an Excelsior class starship. Flying around and being in the background. Showing up, one of those ships that shows up just to get exploded. And on three pitches, like that. Gone. Three pitches, three strike, then get easier net partner. Go oh, the Chicago faithful are sounding not so faithful. Next at the plate, Ben Davis. Ben Davis. Can you think of a more generic name? That one just missed. Like John Smith? Hmm. You know, I heard about a guy once named John Smith. He was a team player. See what I did there? There's a strike with the curveball. 
That was a perfect pitch, partner, right on the edge of the strike zone. The batter swung right through it. I should say he was a team player. Da 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 da. Strike you out. Oh, maybe not. He opens up on one and hits a line drive. With four innings remaining, the Indians lead four runs to one. Oh, they rule that one on error. Okay. He got walked last time, so maybe he can oh, walk again. Miss. Sometimes you try to make the hit or chase your picks. That's exactly what you saw right there. Oh, that's what in the zone. High for a ball. Sometimes you try to make the hit or chase your picks. That's exactly what you saw right there. Pitch misses for a ball. Hernandez is known for his high leg kick, like that. Oh, I shouldn't have swung at that. A full count here. Way outside. Hey partner, he showed a lot of patience in that AP. He took and took until he finally got the free pass. Yeah, it's like I know what I'm doing and stuff. Take a half a step of lead here. Nobody out. Pitch taken for a ball. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your picks. That's exactly what you saw right there. Oh, that's a strike. Come on. Hit towards the shortstop. No, that's not going to be the distance. And he's got it. Whoa. Oh, you're so impressible. Warming up in the bullpen. First pitch. That's a no strike. That mm, not gonna be more batting practice hits. The right fielder. The White Sox have some pitchers up in the bullpen. Ah, uh, this is interesting. Strike goal one. There's the pitch. The runner goes. And he's out. Going into the bottom ah, of the sixth. Right then. Whoops. Yeah, I keep pushing in the... The next batter is Juan Uribe. More often than not, this right-handed hitter has strong at-bats against righty pitchers. Push the left stick in and no supposed to send all runners accidentally. Let's go, sucks! 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 Let's go. Okay, never mind. Curveball on the outside edge. Brown ball to the third baseman. Bang it goes. Coming to the plate with one single today, Willie Harris. Right now is where you see the manager's wheel spinning. To bunt or not to bunt? Throw a uh, fastball because the fastballs are great. In September 1995, Hernandez's half-brother, Levan Hernandez, I think he also played in baseball. That's Levan Hernandez, that sounds side. familiar. Two out. Next up, Aaron Rowan. Well, he defected. Because that's what you do from Cuba. The Cuban national team left Hernandez, the actual Orlando Hernandez, off their roster for the nationals for the Summer Olympics in 1996. Inside two seat fastball, the and there it goes. The and he makes the catch. Hey, I'm sure he came out here with the intention of having a great game, but hey, that's baseball. Sometimes things just don't work out the way you plan them. For more nice. on MVP baseball, log on to easports.com. EA Sports, it's in the game. Pitch taken for a ball. He's hitting 220 with no long balls and one RBI. Ugh. 220, 221, whatever it takes. Freedy grabs it in foul territory. 
Come on, Randy Fox, do something interesting. Keep your eyes peeled, big boy. Takes a pitch just off the plate, one and zero. That curveball is so slow. That slider is not so slow. Come on at me. Ah, another pop up. That's 20 push ups, Fox. Die makes the routine catch. Ty, he didn't get all that ball. If you ever strolled over, got under it, made an easy play. In July 1996, Hernandez was detained by Cuban state security and interrogated about his relationship to a U.S. Her sports agent. Three months later, he was banned from Cuban baseball. That's not very nice. Castro's not a nice guy. He fouled it off to the right. The U.S. Coast Guard interdicted Hernandez. The ah, it's a face hit. His companion, Norris Bosch, another baseball player named Alberto Hernandez. He's done for the day. Comes in no relation. Alberto Hernandez, no relation. And five others in Bahami, Bahamian waters, delivering the entire party to Bahamian authorities in Freeport, who confirmed them in a detention center for illegal immigrants pending eval. The eventual repatriation of Cuba to the, the delivery oh. out of the zone. That's oh, a ball. Da, da, to if the they're going to steal a bag. It's right now. This guy, he really, oh. he's off to second. He really steals and that base. Whatever. He doesn't that time. Oh, man, tough to steal against an arm like that. All right, everybody, up on their feet. Time for the seventh inning stretch. Yeah, I could use a bit of a break. The usual outcome of such cases. Man, that's a friggin' long run on sentence. Wikipedia, why did you do that? Up next, Paul Canerco. All right, that's enough of Oral Hershiser, or Hernandez, I should say. Let's concentrate on baseball and the game that it is. Let's throw the two seam fastball inside and screw it up Get and hit left. it left to field. The catch is made. Escobar. Stepping in one for two, Frank Thomas. He's a guy that understands hitting and it shows. That's putting it mildly. Base Escobar. With one out. I bet he knows Hernandez. Now they're being a little bit more patient because they want to have some kind of make something here. Little, a low fastball. 0 oh and 2, the count. 0 oh and 2? He's my brother, you know. Throw the curveball, set him down. Oh, maybe not. Frank Thomas has 521 home runs. Let's not be one of them. That's four strikeouts. There's a strikeout. Yeah, strike him out. Strike out the big guy. Never looks back. Sweet strikeout. Sit him down, Casey. Casey at the bat. <laughs> Stepping in, Jermaine Dye. Jermaine, dye your hair. Oops. It's hit over towards third. That'll be okay. One, two, three, and the inning is over. With two innings remaining, the score is four to one. All right. Here so comes the three, four, and five hitters to start the inning. Attention to things. I should warm up my setup man in a bit. That's a oh! Back through the middle. Yeah, there we go. Base hit to lead off the inning. That'll wake you up. That was a good piece of hit, but he didn't try to do too much. He just took what they gave him. Um. Do I want to substitute? Pinch, uh, pinch run, maybe. Ah. Uh, hmm. Three, six. Uh, who should we put in? Playing Duchesne is put. Now let's leave him there. 
Let's let the scrubs play. Strike one. Swing at that thing. I and like cheeseburgers. Ah. Two count. A close slider. Williams. Oh, Three. man. Carter, he gets ahead of him and never looks back. Sweet strikeout. This switch hitter has a much more refined swing from the right side. He's got two BBs. That makes him a battleship, you know. BB won the battleship Escobar. What am I doing? Warm up pitchers. Let's warm up. Uh, where's my uh, setup man? This guy. Lefebvre. Do me a favor. Pitch just off the plate, one and oh. What the hell is golf umbrella night? Oh, no! Why did I swing at that? I shouldn't have swing at that. Ooh. That was a good slider to hit, so I didn't hit it. He swung through. Ah! Well, you talk about making a good pitch. Right there, he was really backed up against the wall. And then he digs deep, makes great pitches, and gets the strikeout. Oh, I still have more guys to get out? Okay. So, just a second there. So, you look at the scoreboard. It doesn't show the proper runs in the innings, but it does show 4-1, to one, doesn't it? <laughs> With an error. Isn't that cool? Like an actual scoreboard is a thing. Here comes the first pitch of the at bat. Wolf takes one outside. Not a good Wolf pitch to Wolf down. Play with the first baseman. Kill it! Back up the middle. That's a base he hit. The ball. Well, if I had speedier guy, I would have He's speedier the, the third. Good play to move that runner to scoring position. Oh, goodness gracious. We put some more icing on the cake here. Throw that ball to third base. Vic, the walker driving man. Take a huge lead off of first base. Oh, I was... Oh. Not paying attention. I gravity. That's what I get for not paying attention. Next at the plate, Joe Creedy. Um. Yeah. This is a good move, Kite, because right-handed hitters have some trouble picking up off-speed pitches from right-handed pitchers. I was thinking about letting Clark go the distance, but man, he's pitched so many innings already. Fastball of fave. My favorite fastball. Let's all suck. Let's all suck. Let's all suck. Let's all suck, said the Chicago White Sox. Oh, come on. Well, maybe not. Throw that change up high and inside. Oh. That one's not gonna have the distance. Bloop. The next batter is Scott Pesednik. Here comes the USS Pesednik again. It's <laughs> one of those ships that the Enterprise has to rendezvous no with. Two strikes. To pick up some diplomat or some needed supplies. Strike oh, strike him out! Go away! Do not pass go. Do not collect two hundred dollars. That's two outs. Davis will hit next. Just do it like I tell you to. So the bases are empty and a strike. A screaming fastball for your troubles. Two seamer on the outside edge. 
Oh, is cranked to center field. He's on first with a base hit. Next up, Juan Uribe. Okay, that puts the tying run on deck, so let's not do that. And he swings and misses. Yeah, they're eager now. Let's throw another, let's throw another fastball out of the zone, make it just it. And yeah! Like See that? It's like I know what I'm doing. Now the low outside curveball. Bloop! That'll do it for the White Sox in the eighth inning. After eight innings, the Indians lead by a margin of three. It's the last inning, and it's still anybody's ball game. He's batting 227 with one long ball and four runs batted in. He sure is, isn't he? Oh! Right at the second baseman. Just needed a bit more altitude. Great defense. Now we start warming up our setup, man. Or our, no. What am I saying? The closer. Select. Closer. Yes, do it like you're supposed to do. Swing Ooh, right ball. out of the hands. That is a bad looking swing right there, big boy. Yeah, I like how it makes you swing ugly when you're bad. And another strike gets over Ooh. Two. Goodness gracious. I thought I had two strikes already. Okay, something down here. Here's the pitch. What you got for me? That's three strikes. Oh, that changeup was low and I never dug bad. for it. Sweet strikeout. Come on, Randy Foss. Get on base, maybe. Swing oh, stop swinging the bat. Swing so much. That's outside of the zone. Come on, settle down and relax and play baseball, damn it. Oh! It's a line drive the other way. Go for three, go for three, go for three. Throws to the cutoff man. He's out on an easy play. No! Out of the dugout comes the skipper. Blow you up. Wow. The skipper just wanted to make sure the umps got that call right. Ugh. He was able to argue that call without getting ejected. I think his team appreciated it. Yeah, After doing the stuff. Half, the Indians lead by three. Stepping in one for three, Willie Harris. If the infield backs up one step, he'll put that up on. Jeez, it's like it's real baseball and everything. Isn't this so cool? I mean, really. Bringing in the lefty here is a good move because left-handed hitters can have trouble picking up their breaking pitches. Here comes the closer. Yeah, I just love how authentic this here game feels. Here comes the first pitch of the at bat. Fastball! Strike you. Set him down with the slider. Oh, come on! Sometimes you try to make the hit and chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. Now we try to try and change up up high. Up. Oh. oh! Oh no! Hmm. Base hit to lead off the inning. Up next, Aaron Rowan. Gonna warm up my long relievers just in case. Paul Konerko, one home run. Yeah, I love how it goes to the, like an actual television presentation. This is so cool. This is the greatest baseball game ever, and every other baseball game could suck it. He squeezes it for the out. You hear me? This is the greatest baseball game of all time, except baseball stars. Baseball stars on the Nintendo was great. Mm -hmm. 
And I should give a nod to Baseball Simulator 1000. That's a fantastic game. Oh, slide away. I did a let's play of those two. You should, you should go look at them. I would put an annotation here, but YouTube doesn't let you do that anymore because YouTube knows what you do best. YouTube knows everything. Ugh. That's strike him out. Strike that guy out. Three pitches, three strike. Then get easier net partner. Oh, also, yeah, we're playing baseball. Coming to the plate with one single today, Frank Thomas. Wow. This is the clutch moment of clutch moments. Okay. Let's not. Let's throw a fastball outside. Oh! Chased one away. Partner, this runner is excellent at reading pitches and their deliveries. And I wouldn't be shocked if he went here. Yeah, that was a cool thing about Baseball Simulator. When it, the game was in a close situation, it would... Oop! Out of the zone, that's a ball. It would turn into pinch mode. And your players would get extra abilities. Oh, nose. Okay. What we're going to do here is we're going to throw a fastball outside. <laughs> wow. I was going to throw a fastball and then a change up inside, but he made my work for me. Awesome. Baseball is great when you play it like baseball. How about that? Okay then. Devin Austin gets his 35th of the year. Orlando Hernandez is reciprocal now. Jeff Park is 34 wins. 34! 34 wins! That's ridiculous. And we all know baseball is never ridiculous. <laughs> Fox Wolf Wolf. <laughs> all the animals out to play. Dublers for Fox and Duchesne. A home run for the Wolf RBIs. I was just talking about him getting to the 40 number plateau. Uh, ribbies for the Wolf and Quincy. I can't roll my R's now. I've used up all of them. All the stolen bases except for Vanderbeer who got caught stealing when he should have been buying. I struck out six times. That's bad. But I struck out seven guys. Right? Four plus one is five. Plus two is seven. Yeah. Math is cool when it doesn't suck. All right, then. Racking up those strikeouts. Go away, Louis the 14th. What, what did I pass for? We just looked at that. Uh, done. I get more points. And as always, the points mean something. I save my profile. Whoops. No, not delete. They're doing it again. Push the buttons that make the things happen. Proceed. Okay. Back at the back at the back at the back. Save on mode until the next time. B. Whoops. Hmm. Not that one. Oh, it keeps you out of the whole freaking thing. Oh, well. Till the next time. Whoops. What am I doing? Yes. Until the next time, be excellent to each other. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, or subscribe. You can also interact with me on Twitter and Facebook at L1011 Widebody. 
And if you'd like, you can pledge to sponsor me at patreon.com forward slash L1011 widebody. Thank you, Detroit! Good night!